He didn't just, just regard them as a number on a jersey, not at all. They were a human being, and he made the best kind of man out of them. You can bet on that. And those players respect him right down to this day. Jake Gaither is still a familiar figure on campus, a legend in his time. For a quarter of a century, starting after World War II, he put his team, the Rattlers, on sports pages across America. And he sent more than 40 players into pro football, his boys, as he affectionately called them. Ken Riley, the last of them, retiring from the Cincinnati Bengals in 1983. Without a doubt, the greatest football player that I probably coached was Willie Gallimore. He was a little country boy from down here at uh, St. Augustine. He was a coach's perfect dream of an athlete. And he'd do, or try to do everything that you ask him to do. He had tremendous speed. He had good uh, mobility. His strides were long. He had a peculiarity of faking with his shoulders. It made him very difficult to, to tackle. Then he had a heart, a heart of gold. He accepted his uh, plaudits with uh, modesty, and he won with dignity, and he was a great kid. Yes, he, when we lost him, he got killed, you know, in, in training camp at the Chicago Bears, an automobile accident. Willie Gallimore, great boy, great athlete. 